You are using if else statements wrong. Look at this code. Can you see the problem with using if else like this? In the start car function, we are checking two conditions back to back. We first check if the seat belt is on. Then we check if the road is clear. If both the conditions are met, we start the car. If not, we do something else. And with so many nested statements, it's really hard to tell what happens in which condition. It's obvious that the readability of this code is really bad. How can you fix this? Well, you can use guard clause here. Flip the condition and check if the seat belt is not on. If it's not on, write a debug statement and return. Now, check if the road is not clear. Add a debug statement and return. If none of these conditions are met, then simply start the car.